nice and neat is a Tauma. He's up against an unbeaten opponent in Krupa here. So this um, is the next step up for him. Krupa trained by Pavel Soa. Heavyweights, Czech heavyweights, who fought for the Czech heavyweight title just six days ago, lost on points. And you can tell he's just standing very close to where I am. He's unmarked. Good start from Itama. Straight away, Krupa under pressure. Yeah, just um, making a mistake there, just switching off Krupa and just, just backing up into that corner. That really does restrict his restrict his options in terms of his movement. And again, look, it's a bad position to be in. And Itama is taking advantage of that. Some good shots going in from there. There's Krupa, senses the danger and gets out of there. But a positive start from Itama. Tama genuinely heavy-handed, both right and left hands. Frank Warren hoping that he's going to move on, maybe challenging for a belt by the end of the year. Oh, that's a lovely right-hand lead, terrific jab. Genuine power in it. Krupa fighting, trying to fight back bravely off the ropes but he's not a terribly mobile target, and he's taking a lot of those solid right hands. Well, Krupa's waiting to land that right hand, there it was there, but, he, but Atama is not making the mistake of coming over his front foot, so Krupa can't get that right hand landed, because, because Atama's boxing well at distance, there you go, there's that long jab, and he's staying at distance. As long as he does that, he's breaking the opponent down. But Krupa's dangerous with his right hand, but he's just too far away, he can't, he can't land the shot. Heavy-handed with both hands, but Krupa has that right hand of his own, and Itama can't afford to become complacent. Yeah, we spoke about the right hand earlier from Krupa, he's dangerous with it, and Itama's corner actually noted that and said to, to Itama that he's still dangerous with it. So you've got to stick behind your boxing, that right hand of his, that's how it's very, very important just to measure that gap and to box and break this opponent down at distance, not to come over that front foot. Don't throw that left hand until you, you, know, you get into the right position where you throw the one-two maybe and hit the target. It doesn't need to be thrown it and missing. That's why that jab is so important to maintain that gap. Two of them almost landing simultaneously there, but Itauma Looked the man in control and maybe had them more on his own right hand. And it's bread and butter stuff this is for a time out, although Krupa is dangerous with that right hand. A time where he's boxing lovely. And he shows the power of his left hand as he rocks his opponent back onto the ropes. He's recovered OK, but it was a solid left hand from Itauma. And you would think, as you look at this, that it's surely a matter of time. Referee Kieran McCann just warning him against dragging his man onto the punch, I think it was. Look at his movements again. Krupa moving round to his right, he's actually walking on to a, a Tauma's left hand. Bad position again into that corner. So the Tauma's just got to stay disciplined and keep your shape and break the opponent down with these long-range shots. Krupa showing that he's game, undefeated himself, of course, we should remember, in four fights. And you never really know about an opponent who's never been defeated. Oh, lovely, lovely boxing from Atama there. Just see how he's making his opponent fall short by inches, and then he's punishing him. Referee will be keeping it close, look, and he steps in. He steps in and ends what was becoming a one-sided pasting. And Karol Itama, when he got the opportunity, didn't he let his hands go? Impressive victory, and we said that this lad is a very interesting prospect, and he proves it here again tonight in Bethnal Green. Ladies and gentlemen, at the time of 1 minute 36 seconds in the third round, your referee Kieran McCann calls a halt to this contest with the yellow corner in no position to continue. Therefore, your winner by TKO, Carol. It's His sixth victory, his fans celebrate.